conditions inside the 65-foot-tall steel reactor vessel are unstable. Even though the plant isn't operational, fuel is still releasing huge amounts of heat. Normally, fresh water circulates through the vessel to prevent overheating. But without power, the water is heating up, evaporating, and turning to steam. As the water level drops, the rods that encase uranium fuel pellets become exposed. The temperature reaches 2,200 degrees, triggering a chemical reaction in the superheated water. Hydrogen gas is created. The pressure inside the reactor keeps growing. That chemical reaction is exothermic, which means it adds heat to an already bad situation. The operators are worried about a full meltdown that could lead to a catastrophic release of highly radioactive material into the environment.